Hello, and welcome back to Kelly's 60 Plays. Final Fantasy VI. And this time, we are continuing on. From where we left off in the, this small, ghostly forest. Oh, that's a large amount of enemies. And, uh... Okay, Saban is slowed. Nope. There's the black belt and work at work. And here goes the fire dance. Eighty-seven points. Free tonics are dropped. Ooh, that looks like a train. Trains there, but I thought Domus Railways had been destroyed. Maybe, maybe survivors inside. Let's take a look. Hey, we can get in right here. Sir Sabin, we can't just wander around out here. We have to get on board. Oh, Sabin, Diane's like specifically calling your name for probably a reason. What on earth? What on earth is right? What were you thinking, Sabin? This train's haunted. What? Yep. It's moving. If we don't get off now, it won't open. We're too late. Wait on earth this train. This is the phantom train. It carries the departed to the other side. I don't want to go there. Have to go sometime. I have things to do here. Not <laughs> we can't go there yet. Azer? Whisper. One of these is essentially just the uh Uh, I think just a ton, a, a ton berry sprite, maybe? I don't remember what the exact thing is. Come back here if you need saving. I managed this train. What business have you here? How do we stop it? Want to stop the train? Just use the controls in the engineer's department. Wait, he's the engineer to this train? How? I guess, uh... What? What is it? Seems like it wants to come with us. Sure. Something tells me having it along might be for the best. In this instance, it's just easier to just... Bam. Look out. Oh! This ghost attacked. And it's a preemptive. So it should go down in about three hits. <laughs> Twelve points. It would didn't cost too much to fight. Look out. Oh, yay. Oh, it's just another ghost. Oh, it's a set of three. Oh, this might be an issue. It attacks with the magic fire. Which means I have a feeling... Oh, nope. Never mind. I thought because they used the magic fi fire magic, they... <laughs> I already have three party members. For party members, I can't bring anything more out. Long. Oh. Oops! <laughs> I forgot I was... My curse is on memory, and... The thing I was on for Saban is Blitz. Still going. 
I don't think I've ever seen these enemies, and I've played six. Ooh, they hit pretty hard. Just more things for later, to be sure. Another one wants to come. Howdy folks, I have some great value priced items. What? <laughs> Green cherries from the underworld sounds like a bargain. <laughs> Why is there so many of these variants? Okay, here we go. Another enemy. Ah, oh, it's just a ghost. Why am I looking at these? There is an encounter I wish to... Uh, fight. Early. Here. And it is essentially a rare encounter. So, if we can get lucky... With it, I would like to get lucky with it. Twenty-nine points. Good deal. Yep. Oh, this one is actually really cool. Oh, <laughs> for say, uh, for Cyan, have I just been using dispatch? I haven't been paying attention, because essentially all we're doing is just. Attacking. The enemy we're looking for is called Overmind. It is a fairly powerful attack, to say the least. Uh, enemy, to say the least. No, I think it only appears after, at uh, the later ends of the, uh... Train, so I might be wasting time here, trying to get to it. Oh, the, the accompanying, accompanying ghost is slowly losing life. Yeah, I should save it. No escape. Ah, uh, that doesn't sound look good. Because it's a preemptive attack, every party member gets a turn to attack before the enemy does. Always good. Uh, I'm thinking it will probably be the rest of this part and beginning of the next part before we finish this. Haha, <laughs> whatever did you think you were doing? No escape. Came from this direction. Okay. You can't escape. Nowhere to run. Nowhere to hide. Okay. Uh. <laughs> can't believe we're in this mess. Ready? I don't know. Okay. Time has come to see if my train is pa paid off. Oh. Okay, quickly.
get into this car and pull that switch. Well, I guess those souls will never make it to the afterlife. Hmm. Oh, there we go. There it is. I'm going to have the ghost commit suicide and possess it. And that counts as a kill. So if you're w wondering. Okay, there. There we go. What Possess did hit is a suicide attack from the your ghost party member to do damage. Essentially do a one shot on en any enemy. Food food, bring me everything you got. It is a din diner car on a train to the other side. Are right, you gonna be okay if you eat this? <laughs> Can't wage war on an empty stomach. Yeah, but this is for... I won't hear any more of this kind of talk. Gobble snarf. Snap. What? And all things have been restored as well as HP and MP. Pretty good for the underworld food. And it even looks like he just tipped the ghost. Well... I'm stuffed in it and oh I can, let's go. Looks like we can't go this way. Oh god. Ooh, a bomb. What do bombs do? Explode. And definitely get their kicks on fire. So Ooh, earrings. Earrings are useless in this party. Because earrings... Stop where you are. Oh. I am Siegfried. World's greatest swordsman. That treasure chest is mine. If I were you, Ox, I'd grab Grandpa here and run. You more look more like a man of curious. Now scram. The ox bellows allow me to introduce my blade. Go, guys. What is this guy doing? <laughs> oh god! And he gets taken down by... <laughs> Interceptor. That is sad. We got a green cherry and one thing. What a bag of wind. Impossible. Right, but I'll still have the last left. Pushes you away somehow. After getting utterly ripped apart by an interceptor. I mean, I have no reason to do this, but uh, fire dance him. And that's another enemy down the toilet. Nothing in here? Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> okay, the bomb's gonna heal. Unfortunately. Because I want- I just want to get this stuff done. But not really! Cyan is still way too powerful for his own good. Um... One of these compartments eventually will be another save point. I just don't remember where. Oh, another whisper. I put in the wrong input. And it took- Oh god, Demi, 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 what did Demi do? Okay, Demi is actually 
mislabeled. It is actually, if I remember correctly, from later games, it is supposed to be the spell Gravity. And what does Gravity do? Takes you down by half. Ooh. Chest. Fennec's down. Sniper sight. Fennec's down. Monster in a box. God dang it. Ooh. The Spectre. Ooh. That was not a pretty sight. Okay, so we have a unique taste here. If I can pull it off. C Cyan! Glowing because he is in a critical state. This is important. Because this is a... Oh. This is a reference. A thing that will return later in uh, Final Fantasy VII. This, in this game, is the equivalency of the Limit Break. However, uh, we're not gonna see it. Because <laughs> the next encounter is a boss fight. And we're gonna have a little fun there. However, that is going to be it for this part. Uh, we got through a decent portion of what I wanted to do this part. And next time, we will deal with the boss. As well as... Me I... Uh, uh, actually, no, we'll finish the boss. Because, uh, I just re remembered something. It's just one bomb. It doesn't do much. That was a save point, though. We are at the boss, though. Press this train switch and the train will stop. Oh, so you've been slowing my progress. Oh, and we are now currently running from the ghost train. Yep. And in this instance, the programming is working in our favor. He's supposed to be immune to suplex, but Saban just suplexed the train. Wait, I just put that in wrong. And yes, in this battle, your equivalency of... You are essentially in the equivalency of haste. <laughs> <laughs> the train does not attack as much as you'd think it would. I will let you go, but first there is something I must do. We just re-pick up the other thing and stop at this point right here. I think we're going to finish off the uh, story that was beginning last part. Well, where are we? Yeah, how can you trust a train from not doing something you don't want it to? Especially when you're at its whim. Oh boy, finally got off. I shouldn't be here. Now, let's go. <laughs> Man, you guys went off the rails. 
on your journey. Oh no. Oh. That's not nice. Wife and child. Departing. And Sabin is now off the screen. Oh. Aww. What? It's pure silence. Poor Cyan. Leave him alone. Is that what I'm waiting for? Now we do have to come this way because of uh, something we have to do next. Ooh, stray cats. Uh, dance, dance, dance. Oh, I <laughs> just put the input in wrong. <laughs> just in case, for some reason. <laughs> Fire dance doesn't kill, which is extremely rare. Ooh, we have caves. Baron Falls. This must be Baron Falls. To the south is Lavelle. Dangerous creatures there. And we and the Empire is right on our tails. If we can slip through Lavelle, we can reach the town of Mobliz to the east. Just to come back over here. I have served my purpose. Oh. Shadow is now leaving the party. Thanks for your help. Let's join ranks again sometime. And. And. Uh. Jump. <laughs> Why not? You crazy? <laughs> the, the you crazy must definitely be and speaking. Now the question is, is it actively down or actively up? So all I'm gonna do is fire dance as Cyan tries to get attacks in. Ooh, he attacked the back enemy. And also has Cyan on healing duty if I need to. Oh! And the counter attack came in from the black belt. And this fire dance was essentially pointless. This patch will kill one. And a nice. Wasted, for the most part, fire dance, but it's all good because fire dance is just that good. Man, do I love the music in Final Fantasy VI, though. It is a lovely soundtrack. Oh, that, that just scared me. Seemed like my computer had froze for a bit. And I'm like, oh no, please don't. Rizzo pause. Hmm, he's purple. Someone tells me, ooh. Okay, that didn't do as much as I thought it was going to do. El Nino. Ooh. And he does El Nino at the la 
as I think when he is close to death. What is an El Nino? It's not what you. <laughs> oh, it's definitely not what every day say. Uh, it is a weather phenomenon, specifically with ocean currents, where there's not enough of upwelling to bring cold water up to be used. Oh, gal, uh, or some wild boy. Some kid just found us on the ground. Draped in monster hides, eyes shining with intelligence, a youth surviving against all odds. This is Gao, and he just found us lying, uh, washing ashore naked. Uh, well, washing ashore, uh, asleep. And you are? Gao just realized there's a person talking to him and ran off. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Velt. This area will actually be a important thing in my opinion. Oh, would you look at that? <laughs> Potion. This looks like the uh, formation back from uh, the Narsh Cave. Oh, Saban's dead. Or, Cyan's dead. He shouldn't be too far gone. Yep. I might have another one where part where we go on for a little longer than I would normally. Because I want to get this next character and do a little grinding off screen. Because this character, the character, as we met Gao and we named him, probably should be denoted that because he was named, he may become a. A party member, which is a, an important notion does have a few unique abilities here that would be nice to use. But first, we must get to the town. And it's also mandatory for story, story stuff, so let's go to the weapon and item shop. Arsenal. And the next thing I'm going to purchase here is I'm going to buy a, a thing of claws for Sabin. And is this better for him? Yeah. Normally, I typically don't buy item, try to buy items in a RPG because I fear after getting them, I'm just going to come across better stuff, which is normally the case. But here, where I haven't really been getting a lot of armor, I think it's a good chance for me to start getting them here. And here is the general item shop. I think I want to buy some dried meat. Two, just to be safe. Okay, we just need to wait for a couple seconds before... Whoa. Okay. Now we come down and find the... ...dried meat we just purchased. 
dried meat. And with this... So long as you don't attack... What the... Thou art so odd. I am so. You're saving you cyan. You want more food. You're a regular munchkin, and you're afraid of me. You wanna fight? Me not want <laughs> Oh, we ha have this now. Oh, come on. Me like dancing. You good leader. Simmer down, sirs. And thou art my... Thou? Thou, thou. Come on, gal. Hurry up. Oh. Gal is now a part of... You understand me? Sorry, me not a mean person. Look, we can't have you two prancing around all day. Gal, I think we are going to get on well together. Why don't you join us? I give you a present. Gal gives Sion and Saban a nice gift and thanks for food. What man is rubbish he, you think he... Suppose he's... Gal's sh treasure is shiny, apparently. Can anything be that shiny? That one over there. Shiny thing, eh? Think how jealous Locke's gonna be. Oh, God. Trying to tell us something. Apparently, here, here. Place where you buy food is called Mobiz. Sorry, place where you stand. River brought you there. Now we go Crescent Mountain. Shiny thing there. Okay. Saban, what are you doing? Phew. Why'd we invite him along anyways? Hi. Hello, gal. Mr. Val, hurry up. We're leaving. I told you once, I'm not Mr. Val. <laughs> okay, this Kappa will teach us exactly what's special with Gal and why I wanted to get him before the end of the part. Gal's skills are essentially berserk patterns. However, to get them, you must choose Leap while in the Felt. And you will re encounter enemies that are of monsters you've already beat. Once he tur comes to you, he will have every- have essentially that attack pattern as a berserk option he can choose into. And then Rage, which is berserk- this berserk state he goes in, will use every single type of move that character can use. Oh, and the Kappa fell, tripped. Well, and between this part and next part, I am going to have do a little grinding so that uh, Gao can get a few extra abilities under his belt. Maybe get some more uh, healing items and whatnot, and items from Mobilis so that then we can get to a better point where we can get crew a little easier. But other than that, uh, that's it for today's part. Thank you all for watching. Hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. Uh, and I'll see you next time for more Final Fantasy VI. This is Kelly of 60 signing off. Take care, everyone. Bye.